Welcome back. And in this chapter, we are going to deal with stoichiometry. Stoichiometry deals with the quantities of materials consumed and produced in chemical reactions. To start with, in this video, we will only deal with the molar mass. In simple words, the molar mass of an atom is called RAM, and the molar mass of a compound is called RMM. If you have, for example, C7H14O2, then how can we find the molar mass of this compound? So what will you do? You will find the molar mass of each atom individually and then you will add these all together. So the mass of carbon from the periodic table is 12.01. And right over here we can see we have 7 of carbon so we will multiply this value by 7. And then we will add this value by the mass of hydrogen from the periodic table is 1.008. But we have here 14 of hydrogen, so we will multiply by 14. And we will add this value by the mass of oxygen from the periodic table, which is 16. Multiplied by, we have 2 of oxygen, so we will multiply here by 2. And then when we calculate this all together, finally, we will get 130.18. And because this is molar mass, the unit will be gram per mole. And that is how you can simply find the molar mass of a compound.